This is both an IVC and aorta ultrasound. This is the IVC component, which is great. Um, you have all the landmarks that you need. You have your hepatic veins entering into the inferior vena cava here. It's important to do this in long axis so that you know you're at the right spot, um, which is why we do the IVC in long axis. If you don't, if you do it in short, you can't tell where you are in relationship to the hepatic veins. So you may be too far distally where the IVC falsely collapses more easily. So this is a good view here, and it looks like the IVC does collapse, which is great. This is the aorta view here. You have your IVC in the middle, and then you turn the probe in long axis to try to get the aorta. When looking for a AAA, you don't want to look in long axis. You want to look in short. Technically, you should do in both planes. When ultrasounding any organ, we want both a short and long axis. But it's important to look in short axis to see the um, aorta and then see if it's dilated or not as an aneurysm. And this is the other view here, where I do think that you do have the um, aorta, but it's in long axis. What really was the big pitfall here when looking for a AAA is that you want to stay in short, like you had here in the beginning, which is great. Keep this in the center of your screen, and then move the probe distally in transverse orientation. This is an example of another patient um, and another provider. Uh, you want to be able to see the aorta in short access. You have your SMA here, and you follow it down as much as you can. Um, there is some bowel gas in the way, but you keep going until you see this, which is your descending aorta that bifurcates into the iliacs. And so you want to start by the celiac trunk, and so technically this is a little bit uh, a little bit more distal, a little bit more lower. But I think this is enough. As long as you see the SMA, you have your aorta, and you follow it until you see your aorta bifurcate into two. So contrast that with your patient here, and I hope you can see the difference and what you would want to see next time. Great job. Hope this helps. Thanks for saving.